Back in the spring semester 2011, AU decided on a new general education requirement. In the old program, gen ed requirements were divided in two levels within each cluster. Students would take a course from the first level of each respective cluster and move on to the next level. Now, things have changed. Let's check out the new requirements. In the new requirements, clusters and levels have been totally abolished. Previously, students had to choose between two clusters within one area and then were restricted to that particular track. Now, students will be allowed to take two introductory courses within five areas, rather than taking a 100 level course and then a 200 level course to complete their gen ed requirements. Students have differing reactions to this. Um, actually, I love it a lot. Um, I think the old system was just too complicated and too confusing. I think, I think they're good. I can see the, the university moving in a, a good direction with them because I think, it's, I think getting rid of the levels of the, the areas and making them just one allows a student to pick what they want to do because I've had experiences where I want to take two in one cluster and none in another where now I can take whichever ones I want and really get in full enjoyment out of the gen ed program. I think that it gives the students a lot more freedom to decide what courses they want to take and I think that that is actually a positive thing. The new gen ed programs, there certainly will be more flexibility within the undergraduate program. Geet Jaswani, ATV News.